there. Hello, hello. And welcome to Rachel Gets Creative. Okay, today, because we had a pretty big project last week in that mermaid, um, I am going to take it a little easier this week and do a collage, which is fairly simple for me. I say that, right? Famous last words. Um, and our technique or our special material uh, this week is going to be paint samples like these paint samples from uh, Lowe's or Home Depot. Not that I'm going to actually buy paint. I'm just like faking it. Like, oh, I need to paint my dining room. I'm going to grab all the paint samples and, um, you know, just basically steal them. But that's what they're there for. Hey, hula lady. Where are we? We're at Home Depot. Yeah. Trout pout, ocean sigh. Oh, the ocean is sad. Ember glow. Ooh, ember glow. Romaine. Romaine. Who cares about lettuce? And kismet. Kismet. Pure turquoise and noble blush. Ooh, I'm a princess and I have a noble blush. Not just a regular blush. Kenny's kiss. Who's Kenny? I don't know who Kenny is. That dark one is your heart's desire. Scalloped shell. That, that makes me uh, happy. Magical melon. Dancing kite. Yeah, I like a dancing kite. Green whisper. Romantic. Herbal mist. Uh, sounds like a drink. Dream catcher. Nice. French market. Liking the green French market name. It makes me want to go to Paris. Hallowed hush. Hallowed hush. Blah, blah, blah. blah. King Triton good one planetarium oh my god these people they're so inventive eggplant uh dream dust oh i'm gonna put some dream dust on you you're gonna have a good dream mulberry bush and grape juice oh, i'm a kid and i want to drink some grape juice give me some grape juice mama so anyway, so the point of this, and these are great. These ones are from Home Depot. They got even more graduated colors that you can cut into strips or curves and make into something interesting. So a lot of talking, a lot of mulling over these names, which are fun. I think it would be a fun job to name paint or perfume or whatever people name. Yeah, let's get, let's get on to the project. Not back to the project on to the project let's get on to the project okay i'm starting out this collage with this cloud ukulele rainbow unicat not really i'm just kidding i started out this project by taking an eight inch wooden board eight inch square wooden board and priming it with white gesso a few times but that's boring so i thought i would show you this picture instead Pinterest, there's a lot of cool old 1970s, 1960s fashion advertisements like this one. Look at these ladies. And I'm going to use the Blonde Princess Leia lady, not the confused looking one, brunette. And then on Pexels.com, look at this cool parrot. He's like, go that way, that way. I am the parrot who is the boss. I know that is where the treasure is. And so I'm going to use these two figures along with the paint samples and other materials to make my collage today.
So I uh, changed my background of the skirt, obviously, to this um, aqua blue, as an island blue, as opposed to the green, because I thought, oops, I need to sort of match my parrot here. So not exact, but it's sort of a, a callback, and it will tie them together. And then this will go here. Okay, so moving on. How do you like it? I like it. Look at that awesome parrot. Look at her skirt. Look at her hair cinnamon bonds there. They're awesome. And how do you like my wall? Yeah, I'm kind of, I just got a sample. So we're testing out this color. See if I like it. It's pretty bold. I like it with my chair maybe. I don't know. So. I want to get, I'm going to do a survey. Survey says, what are we going to name this lady? And what are we going to name this parrot? Only using paint color names. Okay, here we go. Also, I would be remiss if I did not brag on my sister for her amazing cross stitch abilities. She cross stitched this. I can't sew or cross stitch or do anything anything like that look at this it's so amazing so good job sister should this lady be called sonora rose cherry brandy misty violet orchid mist or chatty cricket should this bird be called sausalito dream catcher King Triton, Tierra, or Eggplant. I think I personally like Sausalito for the bird, although King Triton is a pretty good name for such a bossy looking bird, and I think Sonora Rose for the lady. But I want to know what you think in the comments. Um, Andrew voted for Misty Violet, even though I said Misty Violet, and that's pretty fun, actually. <laughs> but um, that was not a choice. No Misty Violet. I don't think she's violent. Um, so, 
that's my project for this week and it just happened to be a rainbow project in June which says pride to me happy pride month and I hope everybody out there celebrating it is happy and has a wonderful wonderful month and a wonderful life and I want that for everybody I want that for all of you um, if you like this video please give it a like if you want to subscribe to see more riveting content about birds named Sausalito and girls in a big rainbow skirt and me randomly painting my wall a color called berries galore berries galore then uh, this is where you want to be this is the place in the internet that uh, that will bring you happiness so subscribe if you want like if you want um, and I want everyone to take care happy pride and thanks for watching do you get enough minion in this episode just a second where are you going where are you going he wants he don't want to be trapped in the bedroom anymore fine okay bye <laughs>